In this tutorial, we will see what is the VBA code to use autofill functionality in Excel. So first, let's understand what is autofill. Here on this sheet, I have data in column A, B, C and D. Column C has price, column D has quantity. Now I want to calculate total cost in column E. So here in cell E2, I will use formula equal to D2 multiply by C2. Now this formula is calculating price multiplied by quantity. So it is giving total cost. Now I want to use same formula in entire range of this column so that I can calculate total cost for each row where we have data. So what I can do is I can select this formula and drag it down till last row or I can select this cell copy and then selecting the range right click paste is special as formula this is how normally we can copy and paste formula down the cells now if we have filled column or the adjacent column is filled then we can select the cell move the cursor towards right at bottom we can see that sign is changing and then I'll double click on this and this will fill formula down the cells this functionality is called autofill so let's see what is the VBA code that we can use for this functionality now let me delete these cells or values in these cells I have this formula in E2 cell now on this sheet we can see that there is a command button when I click on this command button it is doing the same that means autofill functionality is executing and filling the formula down the cells till we have last filled row now let's see what is the VBA code that I have used for this functionality I'll go to developer tab click on design mode then I'll double click on this command button so that I can view VBA code so this is the VBA code that I have used for autofill so let me explain this code first of all I have declared three variables so let me write into comments first variable name is my range and this variable is of range type then my underscore sheet this variable is of worksheet third variable last underscore row as long so we have variable names and their types once I have declared three variables then I will assign sheet where I have data to my sheet variable so let me write assigning sheet to my sheet variable then I will identify last filled row so if we look at the data so adjacent column is column D 
and data is still row number 28 so i need to identify row number 28 or i would say last filled cell in column d for that code is variable name last row equal to this workbook dot worksheets and then sheet name dot cells rows dot count column d that means four dot and excel up dot row so here let me write identify last filled cell of why i'm saying adjacent column because i want to use autofill functionality in column e and for that adjacent column is column d just for this example and then i want to create a dynamic range so if i say dynamic that means let me go to excel sheet this is the range where i want to use autofill or i want to copy and paste formula this range could be of more cells or less cells so basis on the last field cell in column d we will identify this range so vva code for this feature is set variable name which is my underscore range equal to my sheet dot range column e we know that starting from e to to e and then last filled cells row number so this will create that required dynamic range where we want to paste formula so let me write here create dynamic range and then i'll copy the formula so that formula is in cell e2 here we can see that formula we have in cell e2 so my sheet dot range and then formula containing cell dot select and then copy selection dot copy finally pasting formula in dynamically created range so this line is for pasting the copied formula in dynamically created range so my underscore range dot paste special space paste equal to excel paste formulas comma operations equal to excel none once task is done then selecting any cell to avoid any error and application dot cut copy mode equal to false so this is the code that we can use for using autofill functionality of excel through vva code or if we need to copy any formula in one cell and pasting that formula in any range so let me go to excel sheet i already have formula in e2 so let me click on this command button and we can see that formula is pasted till last filled row so let me go to vva editor window so that you can note down the code and practice i hope this tutorial is helpful 
for any question related to this topic you can write into comments or send me email you can subscribe to my channel for more vba tutorials thanks for watching